In my lab, we work at engineering surfaces for energy application. And here we show a novel way to fabricate metallic surfaces that repel water. You might know that some materials, for example metals, have a strong affinity with water. They are called hydrophilic. Other materials like plastic have a weak affinity with water. They are called hydrophobic. There is a common belief among material scientists that if you roughen a surface of a given material, you would simply exaggerate that natural tendency. Roughness would make a hydrophilic surface become more hydrophilic and a hydrophobic surface would become more hydrophobic. That is what Chris was doing in the lab. He was roughening metals to fabricate superhydrophilic surfaces. I was designing chemical methods to produce an extremely rough copper surface. And I got puzzled when I saw the surface being superhydrophobic. I was expecting the exact opposite. I was scratching my head. C'est pas possible. Under the microscope, the surface showed multiple tiers of roughness. From the millimeter scale, to the micro scale, down to the nanoscale. These structures looked very similar to those of the lotus leaves. In fact, the lotus leaves are also superhydrophobic. They are even super repellent, in the sense that water drops easily roll off their surface. Until recently, scientists have thought that repellency comes from their roughness and from their hydrophobic material. However, in 2005, Chen and Rodak showed that the wax of the lotus leaf is in fact hydrophilic. With the lotus, nature has followed a special route to make a super repellent material. The lotus leaves are super hydrophobic not because of their chemistry, but because of the extreme roughness of their surface. And with a simple model, Chris has shown that three tiers of aggressive roughness are pretty much all you need to turn a hydrophilic surface into a super repellent surface. It all made sense. The copper surface of Chris were the metallic analog of the lotus leaves. If you make a material rough enough, it will repel water, just like a lotus leaf. The invention presented in this video is a small step towards the dream of making self-cleaning solar panels, or energy equipment that is more efficient, or airplane wings that never freeze.